Hello traders, you are welcome back to the Forex Geek channel and I especially welcome you to this video. Alright, so um, in this video we're just going to be talking about a quick fix, you know, concerning a popular error, right? Um, we're going to be trying to look at how to fix one of the most frustrating problems every trader runs into at some point and that is the invalid account error on metatrader 4 or metatrader 5 so if you have ever tried to log in if you've ever tried to log in and maybe you get the invalid account error um i'm trying to see if i got that error recently okay meanwhile let's just proceed if you've ever gotten such an error you know it's quite annoying right but don't worry this video will walk you through how to fix the mt4 and mt5 invalid account login problem in just a few easy steps now the first thing is when you want to log in to your trade account ensure that the login details are correct all right for example if like i remove one value from here I'm going to get that invalid login account the account um, info error you can see can you see invalid account the reason is that the login was not correct right so if the login is not correct or the password is not correct or the server is not correct remember that there are three things to look out for right the login must be correct the password must be correct the server must be correct if either of them is not correct you're gonna get the invalid account error message okay all right so you make sure that you are using the correct login id okay this might sound obvious but it's the number one reason for this error so you make sure that you are using the correct login id not your email not your name but the actual account number provided by your broker all right it has to be actual account number provided by your broker then you make sure that you use the exact password all right the exact password remember passwords are case sensitive so double check if cap locks is on if caps lock is on and your passwords are all small letters you are going to get an error the, the password is case sensitive so double check to ensure that when you are setting the password whether caps lock was on or not ensure that when you are imputing the password it is exactly the same way you set the password all right and then ensure you are using the correct server the correct server all right this is crucial most brokers have multiple servers like you know broker name demo or broker name live you might even see maybe server life one server life two let me use hfm as an example because you know this is one of the brokers um that have you know such thing like that you can see that there are different server names you can see demo servers live server 10 live server 11 and so on and so forth so if you were supposed to use live server 12 and you went and use live server 11 it's not going to work all right it is not gonna work so ensure that you are using the correct server exactly the same the same server the same password the same login okay it's super important if you select the wrong one login will fail even if your credentials are perfect all right now a pro tip for you do not copy and paste your password okay do not copy and paste your password because sometimes you accidentally copy extra spaces or invisible characters so type it in manually to be safe it is better to type it in manually so that you can you can be sure that what you typed in is exactly all right is exactly what it is okay now the second step is to make sure that your account is active another common reason you will get the inactive account sorry the invalid account error another reason why you will get that error is if the invalid account error is if 
your trading account is inactive or suspended if you have not used your demo or live account in a while some brokers will deactivate it so you have to go to your broker's website you log into your dashboard and check if your account is still active if it is closed or archived you will need to create a new one okay then the final step or, or rather the third step you know we have to look at different steps okay different possibilities that can result in that um invalid account we have already talked about ensuring that you use the right you know um the right login the right password um the right server okay but just to give uh, you know extra information with respect to you know um server if you are using the meta trader platform be it mt4 or mt5 all right in case okay you, you you have to type in the exact server name all right that your broker gave you but if it does not appear in the list you click add new broker for example okay let's um remember that mt4 for mt4 mt4 has has been how do i put it now it has been um it is it is now you know designed in such a way that each broker offers their own meta trader for all right so if you are using the hfm broker you have to download the hfm mt4 if you are using octa fx you have to download octa fx mt4 if you are using any other broker you have to download the mt4 for that particular broker and then you'll notice that there are going to be servers for just that broker so if you try to log in to the server of another broker it might not work all right it might not work but then coming to the mt5 mt5 still has the universal terminal what i mean by universal terminal is that if you are using mt5 you can log into mt5 with any broker it's still universal okay it's universal so you can actually log in with any broker but just ensure that you type in the correct server all right ensure that you have also added that particular you know um broker for example if you want to log into um let's just say hfm let's say if you want to log into hfm for example okay i don't know why this is not coming up all right so you can see that there are um any broker that you want to add because in order for you to be able to access that broker's server you should ensure that you have added that broker on your mt4 terminal your mt5 this is now with respect to mt5 remember i said mt4 you have to download the mt4 for that particular broker but if you want to use the mt5 ensure that you have added the um you have added the broker all right that particular broker you have added it then once you've added it you can now enter um if you have an account an existing account you enter the login you enter the password and then you select the server all right so once you have added that particular broker you have already added it here when i click open an account remember that is that's where you're going to come to open an account and then you're going to find the particular broker here right so once you have done that if you now want to log into a trade account you will notice that the servers for the brokers that you have added will be available because you have to select from what is available okay so i hope you understand so in case you have been getting invalid account um or invalid you know that error message ensure that if you are using mt5 you have added the broker already then when you've added it you can now come and log in and select from the servers so you must use the right server okay now in case your app is outdated this is now the next step if you're out your app is outdated or corrupted it can cause weird issues including login errors so make sure you are using the latest version of mt4 or mt5 go to your you know whether your 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 app store or broker's website and download the newest version if you are using a phone ensure that you are using the updated version if you are using a pc yeah whether it's a laptop or whatever if you are using um a pc ensure that the, you you have the latest version installed on your system be it windows or mac you know whatever operating system that you are using ensure that 
the latest version of that um, terminal is you know um, installed all right or you can just uninstall the old one reinstall and then you know try logging in again this works especially well for mobile users running into in version conflicts okay and then sometimes another step sometimes sim simply removing your old account and adding it again can solve the issue because in metatrader you just go to settings or accounts you delete the existing account with the login issue you tap on add new account just search for your broker's server we've already discussed that enter your login id and password and log in again so if all your info is correct you should connect instantly now some final bonus tips for you always save your credentials all right apart from the fact that you should have your credentials saved somewhere all right maybe in your email or something when you are logging in just ensure that you also click on this save password so that when you are logging in again you will not have to start with typing the password afresh all right and then if you change your password on your broker's website remember it won't update automatically on the app so you will need to re-enter it manually so if you go to your broker's website and you change your password when you come back to your metatrader app you will have to re-enter the new password that you just changed okay and then you might want to bookmark your broker's server page in case you need to grab the server name again quickly and that is it that's how to fix the mt4 and mt5 invalid account login problem once and for all this checklist works whether you are on desktop or mobile so you'll never be stuck staring at the red invalid account message again if this helped you out click that like button and make sure to subscribe for more meta trader fixes trading tools and tutorials that actually make a difference still having trouble drop your issue in the comments all right until next time stay sharp stay calm and always trade with confidence